morning my name is mumuni jafaru ali phd fellow from tuai wagadugu burkina faso so welcome to this experimental pilot plant named two stage high rate anaerobic reactor coupled with buffalo pond and wet dry sand filters mainly the wastewater from offices and houses were collected through a small pipe network a buffer tank is provided upstream of the pilot plant where we have a peristatic pump which is used to provide an intermittent flow three times per day. Two black plastic tanks were connected in series to serve as the high rate anaerobic reactors. On the top of each anaerobic reactor, biogas collection and storage system were considered. We have here biogas in Tedla bag that are produced. A distribution box is used to supply two post-treatment units. The first option is two sand filters where three layers of local available material are provided. We have on the top layer of the sand filter 50 centimeter of sand, 50 centimeter of gravel in the middle and 15 centimeter of coarse gravel at the bottom. To avoid clogging, two filtration units are provided. We have, they are arranged in such a way that if one is in operation, the other one is taken out. On the other hand, the second option is a pond with innovative buffers where plastic cork were fixed on the sheet of those buffers to increase the biofilm growth. We have also uh, an alternating up-down flow of the wastewater to create this, uh, to ameliorate and increase the hydraulic performance. To really appreciate uh, the role of those buffer, a control pond is also provided. To monitor the performance of the pilot plant, six sampling units were provided. We have the inlet of raw sewage, the outlet of each treatment unit. After two years of monitoring, a Shirisha coli were not detected in the effluent of the buffalo pond. This pushed us to make investigation in the buffalo pond, where samples were taken at each compartment and different depths. And also tracer tests is carried out to know the hydraulic characteristic. The biofilm characterization was also performed. We also carry out a bathymetric for dislodge accumulation in the pond. The biogas is also analyzing in the anaerobic reactors. Our samples were taken to the lab. This is the physical chemical lab where most of our some parameters were analyzed. We first took our samples to the filtration unit where we have the filters with uh, the set of our samples. We filtered it with a specified GFC filters. We took those filters to the oven, dry it at a specific temperature for a specific time. A precision balance are used to weigh our reagents and samples. This is the incubator for the BOD uh, analyzing. We kept them for five days at 20 degrees Celsius. And the NTK apparatus for measuring the concentration of uh, the calcium nitrogen. At the microbiology lab, we kept our samples before the analyzing. Most of the indicator microorganisms like Escherichia coli, streptococ, were performed by the help of master student at TUAE. Microscope is used to identify and characterize the zooplankton. We have the rotifia uh, copepods. And from this project, some equipments were also purchased under Bill and Melinda Gate Foundation. So thank you for your attention.